You really have to decide what do you feel is right for you, what do you feel in your gut is best. All right, Lori, you have a deal? Other than Mark Cuban, Lori Griner is by far the most sought after shark on Shark Tank due to her ability to blow up products on TV. Whether that be the Simply Fit board or the Scrub Daddy, if the product is easily demonstrable, Lori is the best choice. And unlike other sharks who have business degrees, she has a journalism background that has not stopped her from being the top sought after shark. In fact, three of the top five best performing Shark Tank deals were with Lori due to her marketing superpower. Lori is often called the queen of QVC. Have you ever wondered how a journalist turned into a shark? Not just any shark, but the warm-blooded shark of Shark Tank. Meet Lori Griner, the investor, inventor, and entrepreneur who has won the hearts of millions with her innovative products. But how did she get there? What was the spark that ignited her entrepreneurial journey? And what makes her so good at spotting and selling products that people love? Let's find out. It all started in 1996 when Griner had an idea that changed her life. She was making and selling her own jewelry, and she noticed a problem. There was no easy way to organize and store earrings. Lori decided to create a solution, a plastic container with sliding shelves that could hold over 100 pairs of earrings. She borrowed $300,000 to make her invention a reality and began looking for manufacturers and retailers. She convinced JCPenney to sell her product in their Chicago stores and signed a deal with them to invent more products for them and launched her own company, For Your Ease Only Incorporated to handle all of her future inventions and patents. She soon discovered that she had a talent for selling on TV. She appeared on the Home Shopping Network and sold over 2,000 earring organizers in just two minutes. The shark paid off her loan in 18 months and became a regular on QVC, where she hosted her own show called Clever and Unique Creations. She earned the title of Queen of QVC for her ability to persuade and entertain viewers with her products. In 2012, she joined Shark Tank as an investor and became an instant fan favorite. She showed her keen eye for products with high utility and mass appeal, such as the Scrub Daddy, the texture-changing household sponge that became the biggest success story in Shark Tank history, with over $75 million in revenue. Lori's secret weapon? Her uncanny ability to spot products with mind-blowing utility and connect with her customers like a magnet. From organizing jewelry and cosmetics to cooking supplies and clothes storage, her company now offers solutions that conquer it all. With over 400 products in the market and 120 patents worldwide, she's the epitome of a fierce businesswoman. Her investments on this show spanned a dazzling array of industries, from revolutionary kitchen gadgets that streamline cooking to life-changing health and wellness products that redefine self-care. Each product she backed not only enjoyed the turbocharged boost of Lori's expertise and resources, but also gained an enduring stamp of approval from one of the most influential figures in the business world. With her unparalleled marketing power and unique understanding of consumer needs, Lori's magic touch seemed to turn everything she touched into gold. Many of her investments went on to generate jaw-dropping sales figures, climbing the ladder of commercial success and solidifying their place as household names. But beyond the financial aspect, Lori's investments brought hope and empowerment to the creators behind the ideas. With her enthusiastic guidance, these entrepreneurs saw their dreams transform into tangible reality, and their stories of triumph inspired aspiring business minds to take that leap of faith and forge the path to success. But here's the exciting part. Lori's journey and wisdom are now immortalized in her book, Invent it, sell it, bank it. Make your million dollar idea into a reality. To see her world of innovation and investments, we need to dive into the world of Shark Tank, where she has invested more than $10 million. So, let's start off with Bantam Bagels. When Nick and Elise Olksak worked in corporate finance, they would watch the hit reality pitch show Shark Tank every Friday night. Nick would call Elise from work on Monday with his ideas for starting their own business. But they weren't the multi-million ideas. Until one night in May of 2012, when Nick dreamed up the idea to make mini bagel balls stuffed with cream cheese. After coming up with the bagel recipe in their Brooklyn kitchen, the couple called their friends and family for a round of seed financing to open their bakery, Phantom Bagels in New York City. Enter Shark Tank. They went onto the show hoping to get a $275,000 investment from Shark Lori Griner. That's exactly what they got. They did, however, have to give away more than two times the equity they'd intended in exchange for the cash. They hoped to get the investment for 11% of their business, 
but Griner negotiated for 25%. The couple knew that giving away such a hefty piece of their business was a risk, but they also determined that the potential upside was worth it. Their risk paid off. The benefits were immediate. Overloaded by the surge in traffic, their website crashed while their segment was airing. Next morning, there was already a line out the door of their Bleecker Street store. Before they went on the show, Nick and Elise had done $200,000 in sales. A year later, they were doing more than $2 million. Bantam Bagels was still growing fast. The couple secured a deal with Starbucks for their bagels to be sold in more than 7,700 stores across the U.S. In 2018, five years after Nick and Elise pursued a literal dream of stuffed bagels to Bantam Bagels, the couple sold the business for $34 million. It's safe to say they turned their 15 minutes of fame on Shark Tank in 2015 into a multi-million dollar opportunity. Now, believe it or not, the queen of QVC even saw potential in Squatty Potty the tool for making your number two easier. Squatty Potty is a plastic stool that fits around the base of your toilet. The stool raises your legs into a squatting position, which simulates the natural squatting position used by our ancestors to go to the bathroom. This position helps align the colon and relieve constipation. Bobby and Judy Edwards wanted an investment of $350,000 for 5% equity. Bobby started by explaining the introduction, benefits, profits, and finally the licenses he needs to bring into retail. The first offer Bobby and Judy got was $350,000 for 10% from Kevin O'Leary. This offer was countered by Bobby at $700,000 for 10%. Robert didn't see the margins and the future of the product, so he was out. That's when Lori jumped in. She agreed with Kevin that the deal was worth more share in the company and gave an offer of $350,000 for 10%. He countered that as well, saying $500,000 hundred thousand dollars for ten percent. Bobby and Judy finally decided to take Lori's offer at three hundred and fifty thousand dollars for ten percent equity. After the show, sales went exponential. Their retail sales boomed as Lori helped them go to eleven thousand stores. They reached one million dollars in sales within twenty-four hours of the Shark Tank appearance. At the time of the Shark Tank appearance, Squatty Potty was valued at around three and a half million dollars. After the show, they achieved $164 million in sales. It's clear that Lori has a talent to identify winning products. She has said, quote, I can tell instantly if a product is a hero or a zero. The next one, Scrub Daddy, is also one of them. This product is a household name today, but it wasn't always that way. The story of how this sponge business became a multi-million dollar empire is an inspiring one, filled with challenges and triumphs. Scrub Daddy was founded by a man named Aaron Krauss, who had a passion for entrepreneurship and innovation. He was always on the lookout for new and unique business ideas. And one day, he stumbled upon a material that could change the cleaning game forever. The material was a soft and flexible polymer that changed texture depending on the temperature of the water. In 2012, Krauss brought the idea to the Shark Tank. Mark Cuban, Robert Herjavec, Kevin O'Leary, and Damon Johnson didn't immediately see the vision for the sponge with a smile. But luckily, Lori Griner saw a hero. Aaron made a deal with Lori Griner for $200,000 for a 20% stake in the Scrub Daddy business. He had originally entered the tank looking for $100,000 for a 10% stake in the business. But Aaron got away with more than he asked for, which definitely helped him and Scrub Daddy become one of the most successful companies to ever enter the tank. Since then, the company has expanded its product line to include not just sponges, but also dish brushes and scrubbers. It's also been featured on various TV shows and has been endorsed by top celebrities and influencers. What sets Scrub Daddy apart from other cleaning products is its unique texture-changing technology. The material is soft and gentle on delicate surfaces, but it also can scrub tough grime and dirt. This makes it a perfect cleaning tool for any household, and it has won over millions of fans around the world. As the company has grown, so is the commitment to sustainability. Scrub Daddy uses eco-friendly materials and packaging, and the company has been recognized for its efforts by organizations like Green America. Lori helped Scrub Daddy thrive throughout America, and as the company was such a success, they even launched their products in the UK. Not long after their UK launch, they partnered with cleaning guru Mrs. Hinch, who still to this day promotes the products to her 4.5 million followers. So how much money did Lori make on the Shark Tank investment? As the company made $200 million in 2013 alone, she easily got her investment back and more. The next hero product is Everly Well. Being sick is already stressful enough, but getting lab results can be even more draining. Everly Well resolves this by providing a way to perform health testing at home. Founder Julia Cheek appeared on Shark Tank and made a deal with Lori Griner. It is now one of the most successful Shark Tank companies, and as of 2023, Everly Well is worth $2.9 billion. 
The startup was rapidly expanding and Julia needed to raise capital quickly to compete against the bigger players in the market. She appeared on season 9 of Shark Tank, seeking $1 million in exchange for 5%. The sharks were impressed with the revenue figures but knew the healthcare space was incredibly competitive. Also, Everlywell would need to raise more capital in the future which could dilute their equity. Lori Griner was the only shark willing to take a gamble. She offered $1 million as a line of credit with 8% interest and 5%, and Julia accepted. The at-home health testing company expanded rapidly after Shark Tank. Two years after the deal with Lori closed, Everlywell earned $65 million in lifetime sales. Everlywell has successfully raised $255.55 million from 18 investors, which valued the business at $1.3 billion. Some of the capital raised has gone towards acquiring other companies. In March 2021, they acquired PWN Health and Home Access Health Corp in a cash and stock deal. Julia combined the two companies into a parent company called Everly Health. After the deal closed, Everly Well was valued at $2.9 billion. Everly Health opened up the checkbook for a third time in 2021 when they bought women's health startup Natalist. The company now has over 600 employees and made over $200 million in annual sales. No recent sales figures have been released. Given the company's huge success, they may go public within the next two to three years. Lori Griner is an inspiring success story and trailblazing journey as an entrepreneur. From her humble beginnings to becoming a true titan of innovation and investment, she has shattered barriers and transformed ideas into billion-dollar realities. With relentless determination and an uncanny ability to spot potential, Lori has not only shaped her own destiny, but has also empowered countless others to turn their dreams into tangible triumphs. Her groundbreaking products have stormed the market, capturing hearts and wallets alike. With each venture she undertakes, Laura exemplifies the essence of passion, resilience, and ingenuity, proving that greatness is within reach for all of those who dare to dream.